Hi guys, so this is going to be dry land week five, day two. Um, you're going to have your warm up 15 squats, 10 wall angels, and five push ups. Some of the exercises in today's workout are a little bit challenging. You may not be able to do them, that is okay. All I ask is that you try your best and you can make modifications if needed. Our first exercise in set number one is 25 bicycle crunches. So we're going to be down on our backs. Legs bent, feet on the floor. You're gonna put your hands behind your head. Apply a little bit of pressure, but don't pull yourself. You're gonna lift those feet off the floor. We're gonna extend our right leg while we bring our right shoulder to our left knee. Just like you're riding a bike. So this time we're gonna extend the left leg, bring the left elbow to the right knee. It's gonna look like this. So right, left, is one, right, left is two. Our next exercise is uh, 15 L sit slash raises. So you're gonna be lying flat on your back. You're gonna bring your legs directly above your hips or as much as you can. You're gonna point your toes towards the ceiling and put your hands a little bit under your uh, hips. You're gonna lift hips and lower. You're gonna lift your hips off the ground and lower. Uh, this one's a little difficult. Try and hold it up here if you can and try and keep your body slow and controlled as you do it. Don't do this. No, don't let your legs fly around. Don't let your hips slam on the ground. Try and keep your body under control. Use your core. After that, we have 20 star crunches. So you're gonna be on your back hands out to the side, feet about shoulder width apart. You're gonna lift your feet off the ground, your hands off the ground. Come up and back down. Come up and back down. Try not, when you come up, try not to let your feet touch the floor like this. Try and keep everything off the ground for all 20 reps. After that, you have a 60 second hollow body hold. We've done this one before. You're going to be lying on your back again. Feet are gonna be about three inches off the floor. Hands in a streamlined position and hold that for 60 seconds using your core muscles. Sorry about that. All right, uh, finally, so that's the last exercise in set number one, age group blue. Try and get through that three times, age group red. Only two rounds for you. 10 seconds rest between your exercise, uh, 20 second rest bet between your rounds. Set number two, this is gonna be a little bit more uh, challenging. It's more uh, balance work. So I want you guys to grab your two small weights so I've got my two little dumbbells here. If you guys want to use soup cans or, you know, age group red, if you're not comfortable using the weights for this exercise, just try and do it with no weight. That can be one of the modifications that you make. So we're going to roll our shoulders back like we talked about last week, belly button in towards the spine, feet about shoulder width apart. Um, and what you're going to do is you're going to lift one leg and you're going to reach down, keeping that back leg up come up, press, that's one. And then you're gonna switch. So this time I'm gonna take my left hand down to my left toe, lift the right leg, kick it back a little bit, bending at my hips as much as I can, touch the floor, keeping that leg off the ground, and press. All I'm asking is that you guys do your best to use your abs to not be flying around. And if you find yourself tipping over, Reset, try again. Left leg off the ground, reach of my right leg or my right hand down on my toe, come up, little press. You saw I kind of tipped over there, so just make sure you do your best to keep your abs engaged. Finally, our last exercise, second exercise and last in set number two. This is the really challenging one. Uh, if you can't do it, that's okay. Give it a shot. It's gonna be six single leg push-ups. So you're gonna get in your perfect plank position. You're gonna lift that left leg about two to three inches off the ground. 
a nice slow and controlled push up and then switch slow and controlled and switch if this is too hard um, try crossing one foot over the other so your foot's not really off the ground but your ankles are crossed and it's still a single leg push up that's going to be a little bit easier than lifting that leg up off the ground uh, age group blue two times through take as much rest as you need between the rounds and the exercises uh, age group red you're just going to go through once after that for your cool down again you guys have a lot of stretches in your toolbox that you know how to do um, some of you might be sore in certain areas compared to others so do what you can stretch what you feel that you need to do and let me know if you have questions